Fly Guy presents Space, book by Ted Arnold. A boy had a pet fly named Fly Guy. Fly Guy could say the boy's name. <coughs> One day, Buzz and Fly Guy were at the Space Museum. I want to fly into space when I grow up, said Buzz. Space? Yeah, said Buzz. We can learn all about space right here. Space means everything in the universe. The universe is made up of planets, stars, suns, moons, and much, much more. The universe is so big that scientists do not know its exact size. There are eight planets in our solar system Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. Ooh, this spaceship went all the way out past Neptune. Moons orbit or travel around planets. Earth has one moon. Jupiter has 50 or more. There are at least 146 moons in our solar system. Many moons! The sun is the biggest object in our solar system. It is 110 times bigger than Earth. The sun is the center of our solar system. All objects orbit around the sun because it has gravity. Gravity attracts objects to one another. The sun's gravity pulls the planets like a giant magnet. The sun is a star. Stars are huge balls of burning gas. Stars only look small because they are so far away. The sun is the closest star to Earth. It is 93 million miles away. Stars are not star-shaped. They are really gigantic balls. There are many other objects in our solar system. Meteoroids are small rocks. When they fall towards Earth, they are called meteors. Comets are large pieces of rock, dust, and ice that orbits the sun. Comets are called dirty snowballs. Asteroids are made up of rock and metal. An asteroid belt is made up of lots of asteroids. Astronauts are people who travel into space to find out more about it. There is no gravity or oxygen in space. Astronauts go on zero gravity flights to learn how it feels to move without gravity. These rides are like very fast roller coasters. Astronauts call zero gravity flights vomit comets. Ugh. Astronauts wear special clothes to keep them safe. Spacesuits keep astronauts warm and cool and let them breathe. Here are the lights, helmet, glove, temperature control valve, safety gear, and protection layer. You need your own helmet, Fly Guy. A spacecraft is a vehicle that travels in space. There are many different types of spacecraft. A space capsule is carried into space by a rocket. Some return to Earth by splashing down in water. A space shuttle also blasts off using rockets. When it returns to Earth, it lands on a runway, like an airplane. Astronauts can live on a space station. A space station can be as long and wide as a football field. Astronauts have done amazing things. The first person in space in 1961 was Yuri Garnigan. The first American to orbit Earth in 1962 is John Glenn. The first astronaut to walk on the moon in 1969 was Neil Armstrong. In 1986, the first teachers to be part of the Teacher in Space program was Barbara Morgan and Christina McAuliffe. In 1999, the first woman to command a U.S. space shuttle was Ellen Collins. Animals were sent into space before humans. First in space! In 1947, the first creatures in space were fruit flies. In 1949, Albert II became the first monkey in space. In 1957, a dog named Laika became the first animal to orbit Earth. Scientists can learn about space through telescopes. A telescope is a tool that uses lens and mirrors to make faraway objects look near. Look, kids can use telescopes too! The Hubble Space Telescope is as big as a school bus. There is still a lot to learn about space. Earth is the only planet scientists know of that has living things on it. But scientists think there could be other life in the universe. Take me to your leader. 
Mars rovers are robots that explore Mars. Scientists are studying if there was ever water on Mars. If there was water there, there might have been life. When Buzz got home, he made his very own asteroid belt. Look, Fly Guy, I made it out of rocks and metal. We learned a lot about space today, Buzz said. I can't wait for our next field trip. The end.